Want to make your YouTube or Instagram shorts stand out with eye-catching captions? In this quick tutorial, I'll show you how to create stunning captions in Premiere Pro without any plugins. Let's get started. First, change the workplace to vertical as we will be working with the vertical video. To create captions, we need to transcribe the sequences. Before doing that, let's make a quick adjustment. Go to Essential Graphics, click on the lines and select Text Layer Preferences. Under Background Styles, choose Per Line instead of All Lines. This way, background color for text will create individual background squares for each line instead of one giant background square for all lines. Click OK. It's essential to make this change before creating captions, otherwise it won't work. Now go to the text panel. If not visible, go to Windows and select Text. In the text panel, click on Transcribe. It will take a few minutes to transcribe the sequences. Once done, check for spelling mistakes and make necessary adjustments by double-clicking on the text. Clicking on a word will move the playhead to the corresponding place in the timeline. To create captions, click on this icon and the caption window will open. Keep the subtitle default and expand captioning preferences. Keep the maximum length in characters at 10 for the rapid caption change effect. Also, change the line to single instead of double for a specific style seen on social media. Hit create captions. This will create a separate track for the subtitle and you will see captions in the program monitor with default settings. To stylize the captions, select the subtitle and click on the essential graphics panel for further adjustments. Change the font to whichever you like. Change its size. We will move it to the middle. You can move the text up or down whatever works best for you. Here, I will move it a little up for a better view. Add background color. Increase the size of the box. You can change the corner style. Remove the shadows and change the text color if you'd like. Now you might be wondering if we need to make these changes to every single text. The good news is that you can simply click on this up arrow and it will apply the same style to all the clips. However, you will need to adjust the position manually, but it's an easy fix. Just select all the subtitles, center them and then move them slightly up to match the first clip. And there you have it. You can also create a new style so that you won't have to repeat this process every single time. To do this, under Track Style, click on Create New Style. Give it a name and hit OK. You will find this text style created in the project panel. Right click on it and select Export Text Style. Save it to the desired location. For next time, you can simply import that file into the project panel.
you will see that style is available under track style. Change the maximum length in characters to 10 and change the line to single. I hope this video was helpful. You can also watch a video on 6 different color grading styles in Premiere Pro and how to create your own color grading alerts. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. Bye for now.